we are here in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, directly across from the Mountain Mile at the Cookie Dough Monster Cafe and Grill. We're getting cookie dough? That's what you think we're getting. No, we're getting sandwiches. And I know the cookie name dough. throws you. We never knew that this place served sandwiches until we went on TripAdvisor and saw all the great reviews of people that eat here for the sandwiches, not the cookie dough. Now, the cookie dough is supposed to be great, and they have milkshakes. They have grilled sandwiches, like a, like a taco one. Chicken, burgers, and we're gonna go in there and show you guys the menu and check the place out and see if it's any good. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. We're gonna show you where the cookie dough monster is located. Real easy to find. Just look for this. Can't miss that, can you? They're on the Mountain Mile. It's right next to J. Dell's Pizza. Right in this plaza. Right there. Let's check out the menu here at the Cookie Dough Monster. It says burgers, melts, and sweets. There's the address. Let's open it up. Here are their burgers. It comes with one side. The Betty White, Spicy Queso, Mac Daddy, Steakhouse. Those are gourmet grilled cheeses. Classic pig apple, and there's what Bobby got the, the taco about it. sourdough, cheddar, seasoned ground beef, leaf lettuce, tomatoes, and sour cream. Italy, there's a ruby, a chili wheelie, meatball, and a cheese steak. Here's a mother cluckers chicken sandwiches, spicy clucker, a Hawaiian hen, a Nashville, a chick me out. Chick Norris, Foghorn Leghorn, and the Hennifer. That's what I got. Chicken breast with bacon cheddar, a fried egg, and maple syrup. Here are their sides. Bobby got the pineapple chunks, and I got the pepper jack cheese curd. You get one side with this. Additional sides are $4. Let's right, see what else they have. There's your local favorites. There are your salads, kids menu, and let's check the back. Got some shakes. We decided to get the cream sickle shake. We have Hershey's ice cream here. Baked cookies and cookie dough bites. And that's what we thought this place was. We thought it was just cookie doughs. All right, we'll wait and see how good this is. Well, guys, there is the kitchen. So, fix all the goodies back there, and you just get to pop yourself. Cream sickle milkshake. Let's take a look. Looks good. I like I like dream sickles, the old popsicles back in the day. That is a big sprawl. Yeah, so that must mean it's pretty thick. It must be. Let's try. It tastes just like a cream sickle. Does it? It was really yeah. thick. Yeah, I mean not overly thick. It was easy to get out of there, but it tastes like biting into one of those old popsicles with the cream in it, you know? Yeah. I mean, exactly. I'll try one more. It's definitely good. Bobby, I want you to try it. Okay, go for it. It does taste exactly like a cream sickle. Like that orange flavor in it. This is a really big straw. <laughs> <laughs> That's the biggest straw. Let me show everybody that. So tip That's, that. That's the biggest straw I've ever seen. It definitely comes out smooth that yeah, way. Like See? with the, you know, the cream on it and stuff. Wanted to show you this place. It's not overly big. There's your kitchen. There's where your cookie dough is at. There's the whole restaurant. But it's big enough. Nothing fancy. Nothing up on the walls. You'll just kind of see how good the food is. 
guys check out all the different flavored cookie doughs. We got Reese's, white chocolate, macadamia, brownie batter, banana pudding, triple chocolate, cinnamon roll, white chocolate raspberry, cookies and cream, sugar cookie, heath caramel, M&M, s'mores, birthday cake, chocolate chip, and plain. Here is the food. Here is my Hennifer with the cheese curds, some ranch, and there's Bobby's. That was called again the Taco About It. Let's check it out, Bobby. Break it down. So it's grilled. There's the cheese, sour cream, tomatoes, lettuce, and then the uh, yeah. meat you can tell is seasoned with the taco uh, seasoning. A lot of meat. <laughs> pineapple. Where have you ever seen pineapple as a side? No, I think we'll try that first. Yeah, go ahead. Because it's fresh. Yep, it's supposed to be say. fresh, not out of the can. Definitely fresh. Mm -hmm. Soft, too. It'd be quite a bit of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sometimes pineapple's hard as a rock, and I yeah. love fresh pineapple. Okay, try that out. Let's see the side look. That looks pretty good. A good size piece yeah. of bread. Look at the meat. There's a, a there's, bit of meat on yeah, there. Yeah, there's too. a lot on there. All right, let's try this. All right. I love That's coffee. a different sandwich. <laughs> it tastes just like a taco. Okay. Seasoning. I like it on the bread like that. It's grilled, buttery. The sour cream, give it sour a little. Sour cream, yeah, you can taste the sour cream in there. It's a but taco without the shell. Without the shell. It's different. You like it? Yeah, if, if you like tacos and stuff, it's good because, like I said, the meat is seasoned with the taco sauce, you can tell. There we go. Got your egg. Got some bacon. Pretty good sized piece of bacon. There is the chicken. Got some cheddar on there and maple syrup. Now, Bobby, you can probably smell that maple syrup. Right I can smell there. it. Smells like breakfast. Huh? Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> a pretty good. It's a pretty good piece of chicken. Yeah. It's gonna be messy. I'm gonna go that way. I can get everything. Is that not look? Here we go. I can see the steam coming off of it. And this is it's fresh. Definitely hot. Yeah, because it just came Beef off the grill. Up. Yeah. They just fry it all up and grill it all at the same time. I like the maple syrup in there. It makes it really sweet. I like the egg. I mean, I never had an egg on chicken. I had it on hamburger. Never had it on chicken. A little piece of bacon. Let's get one more bite. I like that combination. I wasn't real sure if I would like the uh, well, we maple this syrup on it, but... We didn't know it had all this stuff. No, we did. So, I'll be get that again. Now, is it worth fourteen dollars? It's in pigeon forest, so I really couldn't tell you. I mean, stuff's expensive here. It is expensive. But the thing I can will tell you is it's good. And it's fresh. And it's fresh. It definitely is fresh. And I like the the syrup. I might have to start putting maple syrup on the chicken at home. Pepper jack. Let's just open one up. Pepper jack cheese curds. There we go. Like that. So I'm gonna eat it without the ranch first. Do you know if the ranch was homemade or did they say? I didn't know. I didn't know. Okay. That's good. A little bite to it. Definitely hot. The salt it just fixed it. It's spicy. Let's try it with the ranch. Ranch cools it down a little bit. I used to never get pepper jack cheese curds as a side either. That's a good combination. I like it. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna try yours. I'm gonna, I want to see what they because I you know I love tacos, so I'm gonna reach over here and grab this. We weren't sure about these sandwiches, were we? Oh, I thought I would like that one because I, I love tacos. I wasn't sure about yours because of the maple syrup on it. But mine, I knew I would enjoy. It's just like a talk.
That's good seasoning too. Look at that, yeah. That's good taco seasoning. And there's a lot of meat on there. There is. So I don't know which we one made I like some better. good choices. We did. Now we're gonna sit here and we're gonna enjoy these guys. Here are the hours. Today are the specials. Blueberry pie shake. Here is our receipt at the cookie dough monster. The taco grilled cheese was $12. The chicken sandwich, $14. A milkshake, $6.50. The fountain, $2.50. $39.11. We just got back to the room after leaving the cookie dough monster cafe and grill. And a question I want to ask Bobby, was it worth it? It was worth it. And the reasoning behind that is everything is freshly made there everything except for the bread she said they make the seasoning for the taco sandwich that i had they make their own ranch their own breading for the chicken that john had yeah, I didn't know that. for ketchup everything like i said except for the bread was made fresh there oh, i thought it was great now the ice cream is hershey's ice cream and that was a good milkshake wasn't it, was. it? and i love the straw that was a huge, was a huge straw. straw in the Better milkshake. Than a paper straw, huh, John? And you know, and you know what? Uh, the milkshake was six fifty. We paid more than that a couple other places around town, so it's reasonably priced. It's it's average for uh, Pigeon, Forge. Pigeon Forge. The sandwich filled me up. I mean, it had egg on there. It had bacon. Some places you go, you pay extra to add an egg, a piece of bacon. Mm -hmm, yeah. It was a big sandwich. I thought it was tasty. The cheese curds were good. The staff. Very friendly. Very friendly. Uh, they said they normally have cookies there. They didn't have them tonight. They have a lot of cookie dough. We didn't try it. We're not real fond of the edible cookie dough, but if you go on TripAdvisor, like, we're big on there. That's how we found out about this place. If you don't believe us about it, go on there and read. Some people on there say it's a hidden gem. One person wrote they ate there twice while they were here. Yeah. So we highly recommend this place. And also, it's made right then as you order. It's not been set, yeah, so yeah. it's all fresh. And also, if you mention J and B in the Hills, when you go in there, you get 10% off. How's that? Guess Man, no one's at. ever done that for us. <laughs> we didn't, they suggest, <laughs> yeah. I mean, so we uh, we were leaving and they told us that. So don't forget that, guys. Mention our yeah. names and they will give you 10% off, save you a little bit of money. Yeah, and leave us a comment if you go and let us know what you think. Yeah, we want to know what you think, but don't let the name fool you like it did us. We've seen that place several times. Never went in because yeah, we thought lie. cookie dough. We don't like cookie dough, but we need to promote their sandwiches because they do they do a great job on the sandwich. The burgers, when I read about it on TripAdvisor, everybody likes the burgers there too. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J, J and B have, have left, left the, the building. building. Shocker. <laughs> we are back. Bobby wanted to tell you about the pineapple. We forgot to tell you about it. I got so excited about the sandwich and the 10% off that I forgot to tell you about the pineapple. It also was very fresh. Not out of a can. They buy the pineapple, cut it there. It was excellent. And tonight, I'm not sure every time because I bought pineapple in the stores. It's like almost hard as a rock, cutting it right off the core. It was so soft. It was soft. And it was juicy. juicy. We loved it. So that was a different for each side. But we just wanted to tell you that one. We forgot. <laughs>
Santa Claus, 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 Sant